um, let me introduce something about myself. My name is Pat Lu Li, a student at Dongheng High School, Fang Yun Tao. And today, I'm here to present to you guys an environmental problem called air pollution. And my presentations will be divided into three parts. First, I will talk about the definition of air pollution. Next, I will look at its effect. And finally, I will show you what should we do to protect the environment from air pollution. And to begin, I will have some questions for some students here. And the first question is, what do you know about air pollution? I want to call a student from grade 10, a student from 10A Street. Besides 
some sort, some long-term disease. They have some short-term disease, such as sneezing, dizziness, and uh, eye irritation. About the environment influences in although many living things imitate them when they breathe, is one of the most serious pollutants for our life. Another pollutant associated with climate change is sulfur dioxide, and especially volcanic eruption, which spill a amount, big amount of sulfur dioxide, which keep with the cost of acid and it keep cooling that lasts for years. Finally, last but not least, the last gas we burn. The better we are doing to reduce it, doing to reduce to protect our life from harmful concentrations of air pollution. And for example, in Hanok capitals of Ho Chi Minh City, the authorities here stop the resident burning store, burning coal, in stove, and they move industrial factories away from the centers. And so, what about Quang Minh province? What about Quang Minh students? And especially, what about Dong Thanh school students? As a student of Dong Thanh High School, I suggest some solutions for this problem that first, when possible, we should use bikes and public transport instead of using cars or using motorbikes. Second, we should absolutely plant trees because, in my opinion, one person plant one cheese meant a lot of people plant a lot of cheese. And last, uh, and, and lastly, we should turn off. We should turn off all the lights before going out, and uh, in order not to waste <laughs> our <laughs> cheese. And now, let quickly look at my presentation main point again. First is the definition of air pollution. The second is the effects. And the third is the solution for this problem. And now, therefore, I want to remind all of you that the nature provides a free lunch, but only if we can control our appetite. And protecting the environment is our responsibility, not for a person or an individual. And all in all, to conclude, the the like, the earth provides enough for every month needs, not everyone needs. And thank you for your listening. <laughs>